It's day 27 without pay for thousands of federal employees here in Chicago. And many I've talked to tell me they're frustrated with both President Donald Trump and the Democrats in D.C. And they plan to express that frustration at a rally tomorrow right here at Federal Plaza to uh, try to f push for an end to this government shutdown. Now, Pam Kothis, she's one of the federal workers. She works at HUD. And I sat down with her and her husband. They told me these past few weeks have not been easy for them. They have a daughter who is not able to work right now, but without the government paycheck, they aren't able to support her. They also have another daughter who needs a down payment for her wedding. That's on hold until Pam can go back to work. But for her, it's more than just how she pays the bills. Her job is something she loves, and she just hopes to get back to it soon. Well, I'm fortunate enough to have friends who are willing to help out with the wedding and help out, you know, with us, but I don't really want them to. I really prefer to go back to work and receive a paycheck, and I'm really, really anxious to get back so, to serve the people. I think we, they need to just reopen us and not worry about um, the wall at this time or, or anything that would jeopardize that. So, I mean, they, they could pass the bill to reopen it up the government and just discuss that matter at a later time. And President Trump says that he, uh, it will be a while before she will be able to get back to work. He's digging in his heels on his demands for funding for a border wall along the U.S.-Mexico border. Democrats say they're not going to budge on that either. So until then, like I said earlier, uh, workers are going to be demonstrating here tomorrow and every week until the shutdown ends to show their frustration with Washington and push for an end to this shutdown. For now, I'm live from The Loop. Brandon Pope, The Jam.